Hey ladies, I know Mother's Day is just around the corner and I just wanted to give a shout out to all you amazing moms who are in the daily grind. You are doing it every day. It's a lot of hard work. And I read a job description the other day that I thought was kind of funny that I'd like to share with you. And it said this, it said, first of all, if you accept this job, you can't quit, it's permanent. And then it said your environment may be a little chaotic, a little crazy, kind of loud, but it's okay, you'll learn to deal with it. And then it said you had to be on call for 24 hours a day. And then you will be chauffeuring people around incessantly and you will not get reimbursed for your travel expenses. Also, you need to have superhero qualities in which you can go from zero to 60 miles an hour in three seconds flat, just in case that scream from the backyard was not someone crying wolf. In addition to that, you have to be indispensable and totally embarrassing all in the same day and be cool with it. And what do you get for all of that hard work? Job satisfaction, hopefully. And while we laugh at that and we think it's funny and true, we know that motherhood is a lot of work, but I just wanna thank you for all that you're doing. You're in the daily grind, you're working in the trenches every day, pouring into your children, loving your children, teaching them about Jesus, showing them by the way you live and the way you're building into them and your family. And I just wanna say you're doing a good job, mamas, and just keep at it. I love the verse in Galatians 6, 9, where it says, if you will not grow weary in doing good, that at the right time you will reap if you just don't give up. So I encourage you today, just don't give up. You may not see it now, but the, all those seeds you're planting are gonna pay off and your children one day are gonna reap a harvest of goodness and having a mother that loved them and just poured into them and sowed into them and you're gonna see um, the goodness of God in their lives. And I know there's also a group of moms that maybe today is a little bittersweet for you. And you say, you know, Brandy, Mother's Day was always so amazing, but I've had a loss. I've lost one of my children, and I know that today may be really hard. And I just want you to know today that I'm praying for you. I'm praying that the Holy Spirit comes and gives the, only the comfort that He can give to you today, and that you feel His presence in your life and the peace that only He can give. And I know that there's another group of you that say, Brandy, I want to be a mom. That's been the desire of my heart for as long as I can remember, but it just hasn't happened yet. I've been having issues with fertility and we just haven't been able to conceive. And I want you to know that I am praying for you, that the Lord would give you the desires of your heart and that you would, um, just as you're in this waiting process, that you would believe Him and trust Him more, that you would build your faith, and God's gonna show up and do great things in your life. And I'm praying for you, and I'm praying for um, all the moms, all the moms that have become friends and confidants now, that you, you see your daughters and your sons parenting and doing it, and you're trying to just be in the stands and cheering them on and encouraging them. And I wanna thank you for what you've poured in and all the grandmothers that have been praying for their grandchildren and their children. And I just wanna say we are so thankful for the godly women that have poured in to the next generation. And so I thank you for all that you've done and I want you to know I love you and I'm praying for you today. Lord, I just thank you for each and every one of these women, God. I pray that you would meet each and every one of them right where they are. And Lord, I thank you for the heart of these women hearts of mothers, God. And I thank you that you can provide everything they need for everything they have to do to walk out um, their journey. And Lord, I pray that you would come in and provide encouragement, peace, joy, patience, God, in every situation and that you would just be with them. They would feel your presence, go with them throughout the day and just, um, and they would just keep with it, God, knowing that in due time, they will reap a harvest of goodness, God. And Lord, I just pray that you would bless them with every spiritual blessing in heavenly places as they continue to pour into their families, God, pour into their children, pour into all those around of God, and, um, and as they love you and serve you, Lord, in Jesus' name, amen.